Crusade Storm Team Forecast with Chief Meteorologist Joe Calhoun. Yeah, it could be getting down to freezing over the weekend, but right now, not too bad. Temperatures in the 60s, uh, lower 60s at that. But you notice the Lewistown temperature of 48 degrees. State College is also in the 40s. Had a little shower go through and cooled things down. And there are a few light showers back up over the mountains. Show you those in, the, in just a second. But look at that. A beautiful, beautiful sky over the Lebanon Valley. Lebanon right now at 61 degrees. Still a little bit of a west breeze, but I think that's going to diminish also as we go through the evening hours. So a few patchy clouds, but generally clear skies. Diminishing winds. It's going to cool down out of the 50s into the 40s as we go through the evening. And then overnight tonight, I think we're bottoming out in the 40s. Some 30s in the countryside, but most of us lower to mid 40s out there. A few more clouds may come in later on tonight as a little disturbance moves on by. I think it's going to be rather cloudy tomorrow. A chilly breeze, too. Now, there will be more sunshine as you go farther south and east. You go up into the hills, you get a little better chance of a, a few stray showers. Any of us can see a sprinkle tomorrow. Not much moisture. The big deal is look at the temperatures. Low to mid 50s, and with a wind, 20, 25 miles an hour, it's going to feel pretty cool out there. Again, there is a freeze watch, meaning we're watching the possibility of freezing temperatures for Saturday night and Sunday night. We'll continue to and give you some ideas on what you should be expecting, and we'll tell you what to do with uh, those plants you may want to be saving. We're not the only ones. Look at this freeze and frost advisories and freeze warnings all the way back through parts of the Midwest. You can see the clouds are coming from the north. The front came through this morning. That's now moving offshore. The secondary front coming through later tonight and tomorrow, ushering in even chillier air. You can see some of those light showers back up over the mountains. Temperatures up there only in the 40s and 50s already. That's that cooler air coming off the Great Lakes. I don't think many of these will survive coming over the mountains. Most of our temperatures, like I said, are near that 60 degree mark. We'll start falling through the 50s this evening into the 40s. Now, the predictor is saying upper 30s tonight. I think we're probably going to be right around the low 40s. And then tomorrow, again, only into the 50s. Could even be a few snowflakes as you head up into the mountains of western Pennsylvania. Only 52, a chilly breeze, and again, a few sprinkles around on Sunday. Both nights, though, will be in the 30s. Monday morning, we'll get up. I think that's our best chance for freezing temperatures. And then we're cool in the 50s as we get through the day on Monday and it starts getting a little milder as we head on through the week. Hannah Popopoulos from Clay Elementary School in Ephrata. A nice little rainbow picture. Got raindrops, you got sun, you can get a rainbow. What do you think of that, Danielle? Raindrops.